Hello, my name is Dennis Matthew, and today I'm going to read to you my book, Bello the Cello. Bello the Cello was thrilled about his first day of school. His teacher, Miss Melody, was a treble clef, full of joy and magic. Walking into her room was like looking into other worlds. Giant color patterns on the walls moved to music. Bello and his friends walked into their new classroom with wonder-soaked gasps. To make new friends, Miss Melody said, I want us to go around the room, say our names, and sing our songs. Bello wrinkled his brows, he twisted his lips, he didn't know what kind of song he would sing. Hi, I'm Timmy the Tambourine, said an energetic thin fella. He had shiny, flat, coin-like things hanging off his body. In a high-pitched voice, he said, When I move my body and hit my drummy tum, see what happens. And his coin started shaking. His jingles started quaking. His hands were in the air. His feet were tapping away. Even his hips were shimmying. Hello, I'm Finnegan the Flute Fluterson, said a tiny little flute with beaming pride. I come from a prestigious family of flutes, the class filled in. Finnegan whistled and out trickled little birds tweeting. Miss Melody started snapping. I'm Guillermo, said a handsome guitar. See what I can do. Jing, 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 jing. He started excitedly strumming. And a rainbow flowed out of him. Soon they were all singing. Sierra the saxophone illuminated the floor with circles of blue. Polly the piano's keys lit up into colors when he played. The other drums' rhythms even made a bright and glorious sun appear smiling over them. Are you going to be joining your friends, Bello? We'd love to hear you sing. Maybe a little later, Bello said with hesitation in his voice. But does my song have magic, he wondered. It doesn't even sound like theirs, he thought. Later, while everyone was at recess, Bello was helping get the room ready for nap time. You're very considerate, Bello, a voice said gently. Bello startled. Quietly, he turned around. And there he was, so big, so bright, the moon. Mr. Moon, Bello said, my friends sing and it makes everyone dance. I don't know how to make my song fit in because my song doesn't sound like theirs. Beaming down, Mr. Moon said, it's not about what you can't do, but rather about what you can do. Bello, what can your song do? Before he could answer, his classmates started stumbling in one by one. I'm ready for my nap, said Guillermo the guitar. My legs are tired from all that running, said the other drum. Bello's friends started laying down to nap, but they couldn't quite fall asleep. Then, suddenly, like a light bulb turning on, like a matchstick spark, like a bubble pop, Bello had an idea. What can your song do? Echoed in Bello's mind. A smooth and deep, soothing song slowly filled the room. It was very calming. It was Bella. His friends started closing their eyes one by one. Peace and quiet flooded Miss Melody's room. After everyone was asleep, Bello quietly laid down too. He knew he had found his song. The End